President Joe Biden hosted a breakfast meeting with Senate Democrat Joe Manchin and Majority Leader Chuck Schumer Sunday in a bid to reach an agreement on his massive economic and climate package. Manchin has been one of two holdouts on the package and negotiations have dragged on for months. Now a deal could be within reach. John Lawrence reports. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi says Democrats are close to reaching an agreement on the framework for the Biden administration's so-called Build Back Better plan. It is less than we had uh, was projected to begin with, but it's still bigger than anything we have ever done in, in, in terms of addressing the needs of America's working families. She says she expects the deal to be done before President Biden heads to Europe next week. I think we're pretty much there now. Pelosi also says Congress has to pass the bipartisan infrastructure bill by Halloween before an extension of the funding for surface transportation expires. Some Republicans agree repairing the nation's aging infrastructure is a must, but they're not sold on the White House plan to expand the social safety net. It's critical for roads, it's for broadband, it's for water infrastructure, but this social engineering uh, plan that they have, this trillions of dollars, is simply going to add to inflationary pressures that's already costing the average American a great deal. Arkansas Governor Asa Hutchinson says the bill for the plan is way too high. Now all we see is more government spending, a trillion dollar plan that's out there, multi-trillion dollars, and it can't be explained. So it's really worrisome as a governor to hear uh, what's planned. I'm John Lawrence reporting.